Hello everyone, Angela O'Hare here, your favorite Las Vegas realtor. And today we just did a final, final walkthrough of our, my client's brand new home over here in Carmel Cliff by Pulte Homes in the Summerlin West Village of Red Point. Um, and they just recently bought this home. They bought it as a standing inventory home, which is the Sassina, which is a great floor plan. This one's at 2851 square feet. This one has three bedrooms with a guest suite, or it could come with four bedrooms and three and a half baths and a three car garage. This floor plan is also sold over there in Ascension at Incline. Um, now the cool thing about this home is when my clients bought it, I mean, they just bought it a couple months ago and it's closing now, is that the base price for this community is a million 1261 and they got it well below under below base price which is pretty killer we got them a super duper great deal um, and it's always great to buy a new construction home when the community is closing out and to use an agent that knows how to negotiate deals because we got them a great one so when you walk in this community this one has is this nine or ten foot this is like ten foot ten foot ceilings now, the Cessina has the option of closing this out. Um, I don't know if you have the option of keeping it open, but this one had the nice doors uh, for the den, the nice glass doors with the black matte trim, super nice. And the nice thing with this house is all the added features, which you'll see throughout is all the upgraded recessed lighting. So they got a super great deal. Love the wood-like wide tile flooring great color very light and bright if you go to incline at ascension this model is very dark to me so this feels very open so another upgraded feature is this large linear electric fireplace beautiful comes with a remote also again all this added recessed lighting pre-wire for a ceiling fan the 15 foot um, slider like that. What do they call that kind of slider? I forget. French slider? Yeah, French door slider. Mm -hmm. That was an upgraded feature. The nice kitchen. I like the two-tone cabinets. They did a two-tone, like a brown cabinet with the quartz waterfall countertops. All the black matte hardware, very slick, sleek, modern. And they also have the soft close cabinets. Or not, maybe not. Um, but I do like the feature of running the quartz up the backsplash. As well as the oven and microwave. And then the nice large pantry. Yes, the two-tone, which is nice. And the large single basin sink. We'll go to the primary. Another feature is that this has the den with the French glass doors as well. All this extra recessed lighting, pre-wire for a ceiling fan, very nice feature to have. I do like the Smurf tubing as well as the Cat 6 and the cable outlet and the primary. Then you have the double vanity, a nice tub, which is huge, a nice soaking tub, as well as the large shower, beautiful black herringbone tile. It has the rain shower head as well as the you know traditional shower head. I do believe this is probably a porcelain with the bench, it's a very nice feature to have. And then again, the double vanity and that chocolate color that's the same as the island, as well as your no toilet area. And then the nice, decent size primary closet. We're gonna get custom 
cabinets put in. Also on this side is the laundry room. So we did the walkthrough uh, like last month or so and we're closing in a week and we're just verifying that all the items that we asked were done. So pretty much everything has been done. We did the blue tape a month ago. That's why you don't see any blue tape. Nice feature too is to have this, which is pre-plumbed for a sink in here. And that's where your washer and dryer is gonna go. Pretty decent sized laundry room. And this is a three car garage where this is two car and the third car separate. What's this feature? Okay. It has the nice tankless water heater as well as pre plumb for a water softener. look at the other two bedrooms back here I like how bright this house feels nice and light not too dark or weighed now we'll go to this bedroom last there's also a half bath here which is a nice feature that way your prime you know your guest baths aren't used or your kids bathrooms you have a full bathroom here with a double vanity the same chocolatey cabinets and they have this tub here. It's a nice soaker tub with, this is actually, this is not quartz. It's actually a upgraded culture marble that Pulte does. It looks very high end. And then of course the toilet area and then a nice linen closet. Then you have the bedroom, decent sized bedroom with the recessed lighting throughout and pre-wire for a ceiling fan and a nice size walk-in closet, which is a great feature to have. All these bedrooms have walk-in closets. Now, this floor plan has an option of making it four bedrooms or you can make it one large guest suite. So this one has the large guest suite and if you've looked in the model home here at Carmel Cliff, they had like a little kitchenette here. Also in the model at Incline, they have it as a kitchenette. Um, so you could do it many multiple ways, right? Um, here they have it, the Smurf tubing. So if you wanted to make this the seating area and then some of the models, they put like a partition type wall to make the bedroom a little more private, but it's just this oversized large bedroom. Lots of recessed lighting throughout. And then of course, pre-wire for a ceiling fan there and a pre-wire for a ceiling fan there. So that's a great feature to have. And this has its own ensuite. So it's kind of like a junior suite. Um, again, I like all the cabinets that they used in the bathrooms, the nice dark chocolate with the same countertops as the other bathroom, which is an upgraded marble. And I love all the black matte finishes as well as this also has a zero threshold upgraded shower with the ledge. And this is an upgraded feature when you do this with Pulte Homes. And this has a decent size closet as well with a nice window in it. Let's go take a look at the backyard. So Carmel Cliff is pretty much almost sold out. It's in the Red Point Village in Summerlin West, right off of Far Hills and Sky Vista. Um, very beautiful community. Let's take a peek outside and then we'll end this video. So their backyard is facing east. It's a pretty long backyard. Definitely can put a pool back here. a nice large AC unit. You can spy on everyone else's pool. <laughs> Get an idea of what you want your pool to look like. And then let's look at the side over here. Wow, some nice pools back here. All right, guys, so to summarize, this is the Cecina over here at Carmel Cliff. 
and this one's at 2851 square feet with three bedrooms and a guest suite three and a half baths three car garage that's it folks if you are thinking about buying any new construction in Summerlin or anywhere in the valley I am your new home sales expert you can always call me at 702-370-5112 all right, guys, let us know in the comments what you think of this floor plan. And most importantly, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. See you guys on the next one.